JICA Tanzania launched the second next innovation with Japan Ninja competition in 2022 to support startups in Tanzania. The project Ninja started from 2020, which is a startup support initiative designed to support entrepreneurs and startups in developing countries who are creating innovative business models and technologies to solve social challenges. This year, three startups have emerged winners out of 160 companies. We have provided a five month capacity building program based on their needs. And basically, we are a social enterprise that transforms plastic garbage and packaging material to manufacture plastic timbers. So, we have been operational for about four years now with、uh, about 12 full time staff. And、uh, basically, you could see our daily activities. We just go around and collect the plastic waste. Send them to the factory, do the separation, and with our technology, we convert them to plastic timbers. So basically, we are trying to help the environment get rid of plastic waste and plastic pollution because, as you know, every year more than 90 million tons of plastic s go s to the ocean, and these are very dangerous to the marine life. So, at the same time, we are manufacturing plastic timber to help the environment from deforestation. And this is because of the demand in the building and construction industry. So, we thought it's very important being part of the solution for us manufacturing plastic timbers to replace the use of、uh, normal wood timber. So,、uh, with JICA, I think it has been a very privilege for us to work with them. I think we knew about JICA the past. Two years they had their project that we are,、uh, we are running, it was called Ninja Project, trying to spot、uh, innovations in Tanzania and see how they should be able to help them. And then、uh, we began working with them. And for me, I think it was a very good opportunity because at、uh, that time we, we worked with JICA, they did a lot of things, including、uh, kind of like the bonuses. They came to our company, look on what we are doing, what we are our strength, what are our weakness, and try to see how they should be able to. With those skills again. And I remember with JICA, we did some training on marketing. They, they saw a big、uh, gap in terms of marketing. So they strengthened those areas where they, they, they saw and they believed that there is a very, very big weakness. And then if we could be able to tackle that in those areas, we would be able to move, to move, to move forward. Apart from that,、uh, they also visited our factory and they saw a lot of、uh, big weakness that、uh, we spend too much time in the production. Uh, operations that we are wasting too much time, and we at that time we are complaining about、uh, that the machine we had was not really productive the way we want. But they told us, like, guys,、yeah, apart from the machine, but also wasting too much time in the process in the factory. So that was the time that we agreed with JICA to do the Kaizen training in the factory, and then they had to sponsor that, they paid for that, and then we are, we are still doing it now and slowly improving the way we do the production. And I hope that at the end of the Kaizen training, we should be able to, to be more efficient in the way we do the production at the factory. So I think the area that uh, honestly uh, Kaizen, uh, Kaizen has helped us a lot in the factory. So, and then I remember with、uh, JECA, they are trying to, to support us on the proof of concept to see that、uh, we just、uh, have a clear business plan, clear business model. And the way we position our products and the way we market them, this is a very important thing. So, apart from funding that they are providing, but also the network they are creating for us and the exposure they are doing to us,、uh, we have been through different, uh, different uh, big events. For example, Kenya Innovation Week. We, since, we began the, since we began this, we had a lot of clients in the tourism industry. So, we found that our products are really. In big demand in the hotel in construction of、um, outdoor furniture in Arusha, in Zanzibar, in Mwanza, in Dar es Salaam. So, but one of the very interesting parts is that most of these plants, their main problem was termites. So, there are termites we are eating wood and then they wanted to cut something that will replace that. Faida ya hii mbao ni nzuri kwa mazingira ya hapa kwetu labda na sehemu zingine hasa hapa kwetu tuna mchwa ambao wanakula sana mbao lakini pega hii mbao hawali zile mazingira ya maji maji pia na yenyewe ni nzuri na kule mtoni muona kwenye madaraja tumeweza tumeweka kocho kulikuwa mbao lakini kwa sasa tumeweza tumeweka hii haijaliwa wala haijaguswa hivyo vile vile kwa hiyo hii teknolojia ya kujua ni nzuri sana hata na wasa watu 
binafsi na makampuni ili kuweza kuchafua mazingira au pia katika kungomba au katika plastic plant ambao mmoja ni kitano. We hope our world is start up boost social economic development and resolve social economical challenges in Tanzania.